What I need? Um, my brother just pulled a shiv from his own side, so what I need is to get the hell out of here. What about the guards or the officers? I can't trust them. Why not? Because one of them did this to him. Now, can you get here or not? Kara. Kara. Griff, Griff, I'm right here. Griff, I'm right here, okay? Right here. Kara, can you hear me? Jake, please. I need you. Okay, all right. The ambulance is coming. Griff, do you hear me? The ambulance is coming. Jake's gonna come. He's gonna come. Open. Brother's been stabbed. I can see that. One of your officers. What do we got? What? What do we got? Two stab wounds, one in, in his right arm and his left side. Uh, the shiv uh, penetrated the brachial, but I don't think it, it penetrated any major organs. So we need to get him out of here to be sure. Right. I want to check on the ambulance. I need to get to my lunch. Hang in there, tough guy. Hang in there. I think that he's too old for our funny face routine. I just want him to behave himself when we do it. I think we need to use one of our other tricks, okay? okay. I like this character with a spoon. Oh. Very inventive. Good. Can you get the pillow? Yeah. Beats a branch and a rag in 100 degree heat, you know what I'm saying? Okay, okay. Would you two stop reliving the good times and pay attention to the injured man, please? No, doctors are the biggest babies. I'm gonna lift this hand up. There you go. All right. See, the wound doesn't look that deep. The ambulance will be right here. Miller, you go on with him. Wait, is that necessary? Your brother is still a prisoner. Rules are rules. Haven't you ever broken any? Do not let them out of your sight. Something I can do. Oh yes, please call Pat and, and tell him everything that happens. Can you do that, honey? That'd be great. Yeah, sure. I'll I'll have to meet you guys outside. All right. Let's back yes. Slowly. Yeah. I'm gonna need a suture set so I can back this tourniquet off completely. And we're gonna check that for organ damage or internal bleeding. Although I don't think there is any. I gotta tell you, I do like the spoon and the pillow technique. Mm. <laughs> the rest of the silverware. It's not the first time I've used a spoon. Okay. You know, How's your pain? It's manageable. This is How do I know you're gonna say that? What's up? Hi, Chief. He's not going to stab your brother, okay? Until we find out who did this to him, I don't want him going back there. Well, that all depends on his injuries. So if he's closer to death, he has a better chance of surviving? I can understand you're being upset. Yeah, I'm I... upset because somebody just stabbed my brother in a jail cell, a police officer. I am going to find out whoever did this. Well, I want answers before he gets back there. Well, so do I. And let's hope those answers don't turn up more than you want to know about whatever your brother might be involved with. I will check back with you. Oh, 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 how's the patient? It's cranky pain. I'll live. <laughs> All right, let's see how we're doing um, over here. Jake. Yep. I, I didn't get a, a chance to say mm. thank you for all of this, you know? You were perfect. No, no, really, it was you. I'm, I, um, can you stop for one second? I, I didn't know who to trust. Thank you. We're going to get him patched up good as new. Good, right? yeah. Kathy? Yes. It's just sitting here. Oh, that's great. Okay. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna just keep this on, okay? Okay. So, um, I don't want him going back to that cell, you know? Mm hmm. Well, I don't really think that you can do anything about that. You could. I mean, if, if his injuries are serious enough to keep him. Here in the hospital. But they're not. If they were. All right. The only prints on the weapon were your brothers, so whoever attacked him wore gloves. Okay, what about the security cameras? We're working on it, and I will not stop until we find whoever did this. Okay. okay well, let's just hope my brother's not dead before that happens. Oh, right now, he's alive. Okay. How does it look? Well, I think we're looking at a lacerated spleen. I'd like to keep him here a couple of days just to determine whether he needs surgery or not. Okay. If my mother... Jake? Yeah. Thanks for downgrading my condition. 
a lacerated spleen's not gonna buy you a lot of time. And now we need to make sure that you're safe, because if they can get you in jail, they can get you anywhere. And Jesse is a cop out there, and I changed the schedule for security and for the nurses, so... You're really putting yourself out there with this diagnosis? Well, I'm not a fan of lying to Jesse, but... I guess as long as you're at the hospital, your sister can keep an eye on you. I will. Yeah, and I thought Kendall was safe in same parts. Now I'm not so sure. Griff. Why are you worried about her? She's the reason that you almost got killed today. She's the reason that you broke your rib. She's the reason that there's this, this hit out on you. Okay, so if she's in any kind of danger on that island, something tells me she can take care of herself just fine. Hey. Hi. Hey. So, you managed to get Shiv in jail, huh? Twice. What Amanda filled you? you in, huh? Yeah, she did. You gonna live? Thanks to my brilliant doctors. Um, yeah? You're in good hands. I'm safe here. But I need you to keep an eye on Kendall. I? Why are you so concerned about Kendall? It's obvious she doesn't give a damn about you. Hey. You're the one who told me to get involved. Yeah open up right I broke my own rule I got burned you need to forget her I can't just shut it off I may be done with Kendall but that doesn't mean I wanted to get hurt